All right. Uh, let's see. Is it working? Uh, da -da -da -da. Okay. Hello. It is time. I am back. Let me double check uh, the stream. Is the stream fine? Okay. Hi, hi, Ranjay. It's been a while. Hold on, the, is the audio loud? Not loud for me. Can you hear me fine? I'm gonna go with Thunderbolt. Hi, Chills. Chills says we'll urge. Background looks so cool. How's everyone doing? Uh, things are going pretty well. Oh, actually, I almost forgot. Thank you for reminding me. Oh, Darkling, hi! Uh... Here we go. Wanna make sure I change some stuff. Um... Oh, Fusion Flare, hi! Yeah, I made some changes. Check this out. <laughs> that transition, though. I've completely redid... I moved my desk. So my... Oh, like, oh, there's no more... You don't see a door... Well, the door is that way. I, I moved my desk, bet desk to its side. So now there's a wall behind me. Because it just... It didn't look good with... With a door behind me. So... Uh, yeah. So, I I love the transition on this, though. Oh my gosh. Mmm. More Thunderbolts. So, here's the funny thing. This Dynamax Adventure... I joined Beast 73's Dynamax Adventure. He's live-streaming right now. Beast 73 is live-streaming. And I, I joined him, and then I started the stream. <laughs> I don't know what he's saying on his stream. <laughs> I haven't done Dynamax Adventure alone. I think this is Kyogre at the end. I wasn't looking. Oh, Carson, hi. Fusion Flare says Go Fest. Yeah, um, I I participated in Pokemon Go well, Go Fest over the weekend. Well, only Saturday, not Sunday. Uh, Sa uh, hi Spinny Nova. So Saturday, Go Fest. Uh, I got Meloetta. I got Gardevoir with the hat. Unfortunately, it was not a shiny Gardevoir. The regular Gardevoir I got wasn't even 100%, unfortunately. Uh, Blue Birdie asks, How was your summer? Mm, my summer's still, uh, pretty good. It's hot. <laughs> it's. It's hot over here. Roger says you got waffled. Some things never change. Hello again, Carson. Hold up. Who's at the end? Dragon! Oh my gosh. I He said it, we're doing Kyogre. What? Dude, it's a dragon? I don't know who we're going up against. Let's just fly gone. Oh, thank you. Nah, Troy. Oh my gosh, Darkling. You're too kind. Oh, you know what? Uh, hold up. Okay, so... I love this background I have. I had to adjust the lights in such a way where... Hold on. Um... I like surviving, so Citrus Berry. So, I... What was it? I had to adjust my lights in such a way where... My panels aren't on my wall, because I don't want it to be so bright, because then... Thank you again. I don't know why dark. I don't know why donations. It takes so long to show. I see it in the chat that you. Uh, the wait. Darkling says I've been waiting for you to come back so I can do this. Oh my gosh, you're too kind, Darkling. <laughs> Troy says urge has been a while. It has been a while. Yes. <laughs> yeah, the notification takes so long. Oh, but the super chat message didn't pop up. No, I I have it disabled. I don't, I don't have super chats shown on screen, because then people can type in any terrible, inappropriate message 
and to be displayed on the screen. So I don't I don't have that enabled. I see it. I'll read it out loud if it's appropriate. Ah, hi Frosty. Yeah, so here's another thing. Ta-da! It um say I want a web browse, right? I can show you guys on my web browser. You know? Just um yeah. Well, I need to zoom in a bit. Yep. Yeah. Wait, free Torkoal in Pokemon Sword and Shield. Ah! There's a code. What? To get a free Torkoal. Anyway. Ah, hi, Blistina. Uh, Chill says, be right back. So cool to see you stream again. There will be a time where that will be a... Oh my gosh, save for me. Blue Birdie says, you've been busy in my background? Yeah, um, I have. I have. Actually, how's the audio? Is the audio fine? Here's the weird thing. See, um... Uh, yeah, is the, is the game audio fine? Or is it is it weird? Audio is good, okay. Cause I still never got to solve why. I don't know if you guys remember when I streamed Metopia. There was this one time the audio was terrible. It was staticky, and uh, I don't know why. It, it was see, okay. That it it happened because I was using regular OBS for over a year. For a long time, I've been using Streamlabs OBS. But when I found out I can do this, this kind of transition can only be done in regular OBS, not Streamlabs. So... Uh, I switched to re using regular OBS. Now I'm back to using Restream.io. Hi, Greninja. Crass, hi. Um, wait a minute, I gotta, where's that option? Hmm. I, where's that chat? Well, since I, hold on. Um, someone taking the, surely someone's gonna take Flygon, because we're gonna fight against a dragon Pokemon. I mean, I know Flygon's weak to dragon, but like, I'm swapping. Uh, my health is low. Um, it's it's kind of double-edged sword, right? <laughs> I'm weak to dragon. Uh, we're fighting against a dragon. No, no, no. Cross my fingers, I don't get hit by a dragon attack. Ah, Billy, hi. Oh, the blade though. Caporaja. See, they're both steel types. Fantastic. I don't know who to go first. Uh. See, I don't know who we're facing. I bet you B73 is telling us, like, he's probably telling me who we're fighting. He knows, he probably knows what we're fighting against. I don't know if he's, I think he's the party leader, so he knows. Kawaii says, Urge, you may call me the weirdest person ever, but what? <laughs> yeah. Kaparaja has low defense. Oh, does he? We'll see. Okay, well. I see, I see. Really? It's always weird to me when a steel type Pokemon has low defense. Because it's made of steel. Mud Slap, though. Blue Birdie, you still don't have a switch. <gasps> oh, yeah. Where's my. Hold on. I need to find a separate window. Hmm. Where is it? There it is. Hold on. Ah! 
Was well, asked, did I get Meloetta from Pokemon Go? Yeah, I did. Unfortunately, it's not 100%. <laughs> uh, I fed it a bunch of candy. I also used my rare candies to feed Meloetta all the way to level 30. Meloetta is one of my favorite Pokemon, so I'm really glad she's finally in the game. And, uh, what is it? So, for Pokemon Go Fest, I got three, uh, was it, no, nine shiny Pokemon. I got two shiny throws. Like, the Pokemon throw, you know, throw and sock. You know, I got two shiny throws. I'm like, I don't care about this guy. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't care about him. Hmm. Hmm. Kawhi says, put them on top, hop, what? Oh, uh, Kawhi says, I decided to buy a bunch of quill eggs from a butcher shop. Really? Not to eat? Putting them on top of a hot water bottle? To hatch them? Really? <laughs> You want quills as a pet? Oh. Quills a bird. Uh huh. Interesting. Decided to get another. I've seen this as well. The other trainer who lives over there have a perfect IV of Meloetta. Dang, you're jealous. Oh man, I'm jealous too. I see blue bird. Uh, not really Darkwing. Maybe I should actually, maybe I should use my gym team. I have a gym team for every typing. Oh man, I think I told you guys this before. Back on the 3DS years ago, um, I challenged some of my friends to take on my gym challenge and I would use a random gym team and they would use whoever they want. I don't tell them. Do I? Um. I don't know if Beast wants to be a Dynamax or not. I, I'm gonna do it. Wait. Yeah, it's fine. So, uh, Darkwing says you did? Yeah, um, I have a gym team of every Pokemon, uh, a, a, a gym team of every type on 3DS. And each of the teams would have a Mega Pokemon, a Mega Evolution. Unfortunately, in Pokemon Sword and Shield, I can't transfer... There's certain Pokemon I can't transfer over, sadly. And Megas are not in it, so it's like, well, now there's no point in me using those Pokemon. Like, for example, I would use Mega Kangaskhan on my normal team, but now, you know, no Megas. Kangaskhan's kind of, yeesh, without a Mega, so it's now, now it's like, mm, what do I replace him with? I would also have a Z Crystal on a Pokemon, like a Mega and a Z Crystal on the, on the team, each team. Uh, Blasina not on stream. Oh, thank you, Billy. Hopefully, the camera. The camera's kind of weird. I mean, the camera's fine for now. It's just, I don't know, it, every now and then, depending what I do, it might turn black, but I know how to fix it whenever it turns black. I just, I have a software loaded up for, to make this camera work like this. And so if it ever turns black, then I'll just restart, close and open the software, which is like two seconds. It's weird. But Cena says you do. I I did a voice chat with another person on stream. Yeah, I did. I did. Uh, it was Psychopath. He's a he's a good friend of mine. I've known him since 2016. We, we met Psychopath and I. We met at the park playing Pokemon Go. When when Pokemon Go was new back in 2016, I met him at the park, and then 
we, uh, we, at first, I, he was just a, uh, it was, it was one of those familiar people I would see at the park, um, every time I go, like, he's a frequent visitor of the park, and I decided, you know, we, we struck, we struck a conversation, like, hey, hi, so we, so, it, this is July of 2016, when Pokemon Go was new, um, there were Pokemon radars, of course, there was, it's funny, there was this, this group of people, it was, it was me, Psychopath, three or four other guys. We eventually, we were in this group. We would always sit together at the park, chilling. Usually we chilled at, because there was this spot, right? There's a spot with four Pokestops, Lures. We would just sit there, catch Pokemon. And then one of us, well, see, at the time, hold on. Uh, I want a premier ball. So at the time, we would, um, this, this is one guy, well, okay, the radar we used to use was taken down, no longer worked, so, eventually, so no one didn't have a radar, but there was this one guy in our group, on our team, <laughs> he had his own radar of the park, like, where Pokemon spawn, I, I don't, <sighs> I, I don't know what he didn't want to he didn't share the secrets how he did it Jeez that guy, but anyway, so um, I Remember We were at this park and uh, a Snorlax spawned outside of the park Darn no shiny A Snorlax spawned outside of the park and, uh, and he, he told us, we were sitting at a, at a table, outdoors table, it was made of stone, and the guy was like, Psst, hey guys, there's a Snorlax right over there, it's, it's, it's outside the park, and then, um, we knew there were some people here and there that had their own radar, so we, we quickly, we got up and, and walked moderately fast, you know, just, ha ha ha, and, uh, to go over there. Cause dude, eventually, like 30 people swarmed that spot. Literally, at least 30 people swarmed the Snorlax spot. The police had to come. Like, <laughs> the police came. This was actually around eight o'clock at night. It, it was like near a neighborhood. There was so much commotion because people were leaving the park. At least 30 people swarming the spot. It was funny, the cops showed up. I already caught it. I caught the Snorlax and I backed away. <laughs> yeah, Carl. Oh my gosh, Carl. Yeah, the cops got caught because it caused a riot. Oh my gosh, that's why. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Yeah, Carl was there. He's he was part of our group. But, uh, Greninja, did you play Go Fest over the weekend? Placina asked, want to join me with Palkia? Yeah, sure, that'd be cool. Palkia, well, wait a, wait a minute, Palkia, wait a minute. I mean, Diamond and Pearl remakes are coming soon. Wait, no, I already have a shiny Palkia, wait a minute. No, never mind. I already have a shiny Palkia, I, I forgot. I transferred from, uh, Black and White. It's a mystery gift, Palkia. Carl says I kind of caused it because I sprinted towards the Snorlax. Oh, did you? Oh, I don't remember that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dang, now that I think back, I should have recorded it. That would have made a viral video. Because we were like the first, pretty much the first people to show up at that Snorlax spot. You never forget that night? It, yeah, me too. I'll never forget that. Um, Chill says, as of what I've, I've been doing while you're on break, my 2D Metroid Marathon. I've been playing every game for my first time. Really? I still want to finish Metroid Fusion. Well, I don't, I don't have the game anymore, but mm, my first Metroid game was Metroid Fusion. I don't know how far I got. 
I got moderately far. It was, it was, I had so much fun. It's just, I stopped playing because, I don't know, some new game came out and I don't know. I don't remember, but I don't have the game anymore. Oh, there's someone to record on YouTube? Ah, hard to find, huh? Lucina asked, uh, what if Palkia and Dialga got shiny locked? It's whatever. I mean, I, well, I already have a shiny Palkia and Dialga, so... From black and white to the mystery gift, I already... I don't care if it's shiny locked on, on the Diamond Pearl remake. That'd be weird, but... Okay, I'm getting hot. I'll take the sweater off. Anna, hi! Yeah. Kawhi says my brother's allergic to dogs. Oh yeah, oh wait a minute, hold up, hold up. Okay, um, Torkoal, I want this free, it's, I don't think it's shiny though. Um, get mystery gift via code. Here it is, okay. Oh, the code until July 19th, that's today. Mm, hopefully it's still up. I don't know, does that mean it's gone or today's the last day? I don't know, oh my gosh. Uh, PJCS. Uh, 2020 champ. It's a weird code. Oh, it's expired. Dang. Oh, well. Blue Birdie says, sorry, I gotta go. Okay. Great to see you. Goodbye, Blue Birdie. So long. Farewell. <laughs> Who's that Pokemon? Oh my gosh, who could it possibly be? <laughs> Plot twist is Gigantamax. A new gift. Oh, but if you participate in the verses online, yeah, stadium rewards. Okay, never mind. All right. What's Torkoal's special move? Uh, I don't know. That Torkoal is what the champion used. I, th I, I think, well, last year's champion used that Torkoal, I think. So I don't, I don't know. I don't think it would have any special moves that it can't normally learn. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna do Tapu Fini. I still want a shiny Tapu Fini. That is true, and uh, it is Gigantamax Orbital. Um, what was the code I used to use? Oh my gosh, what was it? 7823, 7823, I think it was, I think that was it. I don't know if anyone, how many people, I don't know. Cartendo, Pink Cow, you beat Metro Fusion, dang. That is true, Beast, that is true. Um, I, hold on, I gotta, gotta do something. Um, Oh my gosh, Spinning Nova. <laughs> You've been hypnotized by the lights? 
Uh, let me let me go back here. Yeah, Blastina. Oh, so let me show you this. So, um, you know what's funny? I didn't realize I've had this all these years. This is mine, by the way. I didn't just buy it on eBay like recently. This is the this is I bought this when I was a kid. This is the same box. I'm surprised. I still have this. It was just tucked away in a box, so I still have the Game Boy Advance box. That's funny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, you can probably see right here. The I have... That's, that's my Game Boy Color. There's Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow on that side, and then Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal on this side. The cartridges, so that's pretty cool. Here we got throwing out the box for a Super NES 3DS XL. Really? Uh, well, Placina says, how much? 700 bucks? What, for the Game Boy Advance? No, no way. Gosh, no. How, is there a price on this? No, there's no... No price tag. Huh. Oh my gosh. Spinning No Mrs. Hoarders Gamer Edition? Jeez. <laughs> oh yeah, I actually have this block, don't I? I have the Pokemon Power final uh, issue. If you guys see it right there. I didn't even realize. So there are six, is six issues of this. So... I have the final issue. I didn't even know there were- that was- that was it, so... That's pretty funny. I guess no one else is joining. There's another code? Player's choice. Oh, um... Uh, PC? Really? What does that give? Alright, so it's just you and me, Blastina. Um... So Tapu Fini... It's water and fairy. That is bad. I guess I'll go with you. Gosh, I don't like these these options. That's fine, Darkling. Hi, Seth. Give this a gold bottle cap? Oh? Um... Fighting, ghost, ground, flying, psych- What? What are these typings? What? I don't even know. I saw Rotom on the left side, but Rotom... Uh, sure. Seth? No. Actually, no. <laughs> no. Come to think of it, though, I haven't really been going to many places since the pandemic started. There was this one time. I think it was 2019. It was during Torchic. Was it Torchic Community Day? I think so. Um, I went to a park, and there was this kid. He was cosplaying as a Torchic. He and he, well, he was just wearing like an orange shirt with like feathers on his shoulders, right? But he made this paper mache, paper mache ball on, on his head, Torchic's face, this big. This, a paper mache big head of Torchic. <laughs> it was so funny. I should have gotten a picture of it, dang. <laughs> that kid was dedicated. <laughs> oh, thank you, Lucario. I remember this, uh, in the year, so 2019, um, what was 2018? Sometimes I go to this uh, universe. So my old university I graduated from, 
Uh, I sometimes go back to the campus. It's a big campus, and it's a fantastic place to play Pokemon Go because there's Pokemon Poke stops everywhere and gyms everywhere. Students battling in those raids everywhere. So, I and I I mean I know my way around the campus because I graduate. I used to I attend there for for quite some time, and so I sometimes go back to Pokemon Go events and. Um, that was, so it was, was it 2019 or 2018? Halloween. It was on Halloween, I went there. I was I was playing Pokemon Go, and um, there, there, someone was dressed up as Pikachu, as an, as an inflatable Pikachu. It was so funny. You know those, you know those dinosaur uh, inflatable costumes people run around in? Like the dinosaur head is up here. Right? Have you seen you seen those those costumes? It looks like it's inflatable. Anyway, there's a Pikachu version of it, and uh, so so it's just as, a, as an inflatable Pikachu. It's funny. I got my picture taken with that person. <laughs> it was on campus. That's just funny. Mr. Mime. No. What's gonna says I want that shiny throw so bad because I'm living in Europe. Really? Gosh, I, I really don't care about shiny throw. I wish, dude. So, I wait. Well, that's Blaziken. Nah, but we're going against uh, Tapu Fini. It's a fairy water type. She's Rotom. So, um, what was I saying? So, um, <sighs> wow, I forgot what I was gonna say. Throw in soccer regional. Oh, oh, are they? Wait. Oh, I did not know that. Where is, wait, so who, ha where does Throw and Sock spawn? What? I didn't even know they're, I didn't know they're regional. Wow. Um, Sucker Punch. Rotom has Levitate, so I'm not gonna use high horsepower. Hopefully Rotom attacks, so my Sucker Punch can work. Throw is in the US? Oh, okay. Seth says I need the Pikachu one. <laughs> Where's your favorite spot to play Pokemon Go besides your old school? Um, there are two parks. Big parks. In my city, um, there are two most popular parks that a lot of Pokemon Go players go to. One is 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 in downtown, and the other one is I don't know. I gotta drive up north. It's like 20 minute drive. It's it's kind of I gotta drive on the highway for like 15 to 20 minutes to get up there. It's kind of it's kind of quite the drive on the highway too. So it's, it depends if there's traffic, but um. Yeah, there, there are two popular parks. Lucina says, just like Lunatone, Solrog, Durant, Heatmore, Zangoose, and Surviper. Because those are shiny. Ah, oh, okay. Um. Oh yeah, so, oh yeah, I remember now what I was gonna say. So, I, okay, so now you guys know Gardevoir is my favorite Pokemon ever, right? Uh, I was so happy to get the Gardevoir wearing Meloetta's hat, right? Um, I was crossing my fingers for a 100% Gardevoir, but see, I wasn't sure if it was possible to get a shiny. I would assume so, cause, you know, Shiny Guard Wars in the game, so it's like, man, that'd be cool if it's a possible. I don't know. Unfortunately, I, I got I caught two Guard Wars with the hat. They weren't shiny. I wasn't sure, and then I saw a screenshot on on the internet, like someone posted they got a shiny Zigzagoon and shiny Ponyta with the hat. Um. I'll switch. Oh, Blistina wanted it. Huh? 
Who's that? That's Raichu. Yes! Whoa! Why we go flying? What? But Tapu Fini is... Is... Fairy and water. Raichu has electric... What? Right. That's Mantine, though. What does Mantine have? Well, I mean, Mantine can resist water. Uh, I guess you like resistance more so. Unless Mantine has some super effective move that I don't know about. Mantine has water absorb. Oh, water absorb. What? I did not know. See, Blasima, you you know so much. <laughs> I mean, it's four times weak to electric. Should I nasty ball? Let me just see how much damage I can do with Electro Ball. Man, Blasina, I don't know how you have this stuff memorized in Dynamax Adventures. I mean, I know there's there's information on, on the internet about what all these, you know, these Pokemon's attacks and abilities are, but man, I just... <laughs> I don't have this stuff memorized. <laughs> I just go by face value what I see on the shadow and typing. <laughs> Darkling is pushing the places 24 7. Oh my gosh. <laughs> right, I'm gonna nasty plot. Julian, wow, hi. Seth, you found the Pikachu? Anna says, uh, I recently got the expansion by buying online and got a code from Lost Me so I can probably join you live. Oh! You have the DLC! Huh. So wait, did, did you start it yet? Or... Thank you, Julian. And it says I did Dynamax solo and got some shinies when I played. Oh, okay, so you've already reached that spot. Julian asked how much were those Cloud and Sephiroth figures? I got them years ago. Um gosh, it's Sephiroth. It's funny, I did a I think Sephiroth was like I don't remember. Was it between $130 to $150? I bought it on the Square Enix. Uh, official store. It's funny because I, I made a YouTube video years ago when they first announced Sephiroth. They first announced Sephiroth figure. I did a YouTube video. It's a it's a funny, funny kind of skit. Um, did wait a minute? Did they? Was it pre-orders were up, but I think they were sold out. Was it? I think I was clicking. I don't remember. I wanted to pre-order, but I think they were sold out already. Is that what happened? I don't remember. Um, but the cloud figure, I assume it's priced the same amount as Sephiroth. However, I paid like, I think, was it 80 or 70 bucks for the cloud figure? And the funny thing is, they sent me the wrong cloud. That cloud figure, so both Sephiroth and Cloud, that's the Play Arts Kai figure. Which, it's really good. It's pretty detailed. Um, I ordered this cloud on Amazon.com. I was I wanted to buy this $80 was a $70 cloud figure. It, it you know it was low quality. It was still cool. But I bought this, and when I got this Player Sky version in the mail. And uh, I was like, what? Because this is worth, like, what? Between 130 to 150 And yet I pay, like, 70 to 80 bucks. They sent me the wrong... They sent me a, a better one. Whoa! So I was like, shh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> 
Plastina says my internet is out. Oh no. Dang. All right. AI time. I'm gonna use Nasty Plot. Or should I Will-O-Wisp? I mean, I know it's a special attacker, but like, I'm gonna use Nasty Plot. Makari says, are you doing random Dynamax adventures or are you hunting a certain one? Uh, well this one, uh, this is not random. I chose Tapu Fini. I still have Tapu Fini, Tapu Lele bookmarked, because I still want their shiny variants. You can't get Tapu Lele? Dang. Uh, Anna says, here are shinies I got at Dynamics Adventure. Driftblim, Cincino, and Piloswine. Oh, okay. Man, I have a lot of shiny smite ups from the Pokemon Go Community Day. The car stuff, Necrozma, Ho, and Latios if you want. Really? Huh. I don't have shiny. So I have I have a shiny Latias I caught in Pokemon Go. I transferred over just to Pokemon Sword. I don't have a shiny Latios though. Hmm. Hmm. I don't have shiny Necrozma either. Hmm. Necrozma can turn into, you know, two different two other forms. Hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, yes, Lucario, I would love to join your Necrozma, or Latios, or I don't have a Shiny Ho either, or do I? I don't remember. Do I have an event? Shiny Ho? No. No, I don't think I even have any event Ho, or do I? Well, I know Shiny Ho event was... That was a thing, that happened. I don't know. Gen 4? Gen 5? I don't remember. I think that was a thing, but I don't have it. But Necrozma, I do, I would like to try out Necrozma. Sav says, you really need to make a video on the Game Boy Advance in your background, that is awesome. Make a video on the Game Boy Advance? I don't know, how would you even... The thing is, I... How many Game Boy Advance games have I even played? I haven't played a whole lot. The only Game Boy Advance games, I, Game Boy Advance is like, I have fond memories. That's I, I would say Game Boy Advance is probably my favorite portable Nintendo console. Uh, I don't know, Game Boy Advance, it was just an eye opener for me. It was especially Golden Sun. Like graphically, it. Oh my gosh, the only games I played on Game Boy Advance is Golden Sun one and two. All the Pokemon games, mainline games. Um, Kingdom Hearts, Chain of Memories. I lost that cartridge, unfortunately. Hi, Chris. Um, uh, Blake plays, what? Plot twist. <laughs> Blake, waiting for Marmaker 2 to return. I don't... <sighs> Lately, my taste has changed. Luxury Ball. Chris, is that who I see in the background? Ha! Ah, you saw nothing, Chris! You see nothing. <laughs> oh wait, you still see it, dang. <laughs> uh, you see nothing. <laughs> like you know how Pokemon? Dang. Chills. Uh, hold on, hold on. Let me see. Moment of truth. Any shinies? Dang, no shiny. Joseph Mew has a regular throw. Insert Toad breakdancing. Oh my gosh. Chills has also been playing too much Smash this year. This year? 
plot twist. Uh, Jill says, uh, plan to do my... Planning to going to Nintendo New York on Metroid Dread's release since my birthday is the day after. Oh, wow, really? Man, I, I would love to go back to Nintendo store in New York. I went there once. I took pictures. I have a picture of myself getting punched by Donkey Kong in the face, so... <laughs> have I ever posted that anywhere? I don't know. <laughs> Did I ever post that on Twitter? Oh. Anna says oh, Shiny's I got because I was trying to catch Zygarde, but he was so hard until uh, I finally beat it and ca caught it. Ooh. The car says on my code when you're ready. Oh, sorry. Frosty, you have a suggestion? Julian says I only love it for giving me the single best Kirby game ever. Oh. So you're gonna oh you're gonna do uh dynamax adventures looking uh going for palkia i see i see i'm not really interested in palkia i already have a shiny palkia so i'm gonna do necrozma with lucario oh i also have stack attack bookmarked i, I do want to get the ultra beasts as a shiny but i mean it's kind of not important i'd rather get the tapus first as a shiny Skylar, hi! It's been a while. Oh, Julian, Amazing Mirror. It's the most underrated Kirby game ever. Mmm, okay, okay. The car says... Ah, twice? Okay. Did it show up the first time? No, I don't think your code showed up the first time. I don't know why that's a thing. That happens to Needs, though, too, when he would po post a code in the chat. It wouldn't show up. I don't know why. I have some filters in place to filter out some certain words that are bad, some bad words, but like, numbers? It's kind of weird that they won't even show up. Oh, Anna. Anna says, when you do this dynamics adventure, can you join mine next? Wait, Anna, what, but what's your, what, what legendary are you going after? Like, just not sure if I'm actually gonna turn. Oh, that? Oh! <laughs> turn the sketches into a mod. Ah. Uh... Oh, Planet Robobot is your top two Kirby game. Ah, uh, Robobot on, on. That's on 3DS, I recall. You two are not connected at all. Oh! Wait, I'm not connected. Wait, no, I am connected. I, I, I was. I connected with Bastina. Your the car, you're connected? Okay. Uh, Chill says nothing beats Super Star Ultra for me. That sounds like that sounds like what you would slap on to the end of any title. <laughs> Welcome to Pokemon Super Star Ultra with funky co with a uh, with, with the new funky mode, <laughs> including Dante. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I'm sorry, Darkling. Hey, I found Lucario! Cool. Blake, the, your emote suggestion? Oh my gosh, urge to shock or surprise? Frosty, I just saw your emote suggestion. What? Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, Blake, no, I didn't include your... The emote, that's like, wait, what? Is that like a stick figure of, of you? Wait, I think, wait, didn't I add an emote? Wait a minute, I add I added an e emo of yours months ago, right? Or or is it not there anymore? No one even used it. Or did I remove it? Because no one used it. Nurse to shock. <laughs> Jolene says the switch tree Kirby so sadly. Oh. I see Blake. Featuring Dante. Dante according to Smash. Oh my gosh. I know, right? <laughs> Um, who are we fighting? Oh yeah, Necrozma. Necrozma is, is only a psychic type, right? I don't think it's secondary typing. Um, well dang. I mean, both these Pokemon are weak to psychic, so that sucks. Greedent? Ugh. I mean, at least it has Sword Stance to make up for... I mean, that'd be cool if Body Sam can, can paralyze. On first try. <laughs> oh boy. Whoa, Star Warrior, hi. Urge the Dynamax. I don't know about that. Hi, Jake. Favorite Kirby game is Star Allies. I like Star Allies when I, I have I so I, I don't have I don't own the game, but I play the demo. That's pretty cool. I don't think it has online multiplayer though, right? Which is sad. It's unfortunate. Ghost! That's a thing. Who else? Phalanx up there. Does Gorgas even have any ghost attacks? I don't know. Because you know Dynamax Adventure, these Pokemon, they don't always have a typing of, of that match. They don't have a, an attack that matches their typing. It's kind of it's kind of weird. <laughs> Julian says, I wanted a new Kirby game to reveal an E3. We've seen this is they have lightning rod. Oh, the Raichu has lightning rod, but does Necrozma have any electric attacks? Do we need that? Protection? Can we switch spinoffs? Have online though? Yeah, they have online, but spin-off game, it's it's kinda Well, wait a minute, but I forgot, what is that free-to-play one? I just don't like the fact that it's free-to-play. Because then there's these gems, microtransactions, you know, the whole stamina. You can only do so much before you gotta stop playing or else you pay money. Star Wars is only been a year since we played game. I mean, does there need to be a new Kirby game every year? It's kind of how I feel with Pokemon. Like, they, they keep releasing a new Pokemon game every year. Well, typically anyway. I know. There was no Pokemon Z they skipped that year. But, uh, I don't know. It, I don't mind waiting, like, every two years. I don't really need a new, a new game of a... A franchise I love every year. Skylar says, 
Kirby Clash is a bit controversial in the community? I bet. I don't like the free-to-play model. The Crossman is charged me. Oh, does it? Oh, I did not know that. Okay, dang. Yeah, Raichu would have been a, a good pick. Where is this? Because they said they'll make a new a new game on 2021? Oh. Wait, when did they say that? Was that, like, post-pandemic? How recent was that? Because that pandemic... Last year, really, it shook, it changed, it just, it shook everyone's schedule, all gaming schedule releases. <laughs> uh, Jillian says no because of how fans blasted both Star Allies for being too short and Fighters 2 for being a smash ripoff. Uh, I just wish they had GB online so I can play the past GB games. Man, I wish they came out with Game Boy Advance games online service with the Nintendo Switch online. Just like NES and Super NES. Lucario asks who should take it. I don't know. Uh, I'll I'll pass. If need be. I'm still fine. Oh! Blastia took damage! Dang! I'm skipping. Oh, the NPC wants it! <laughs> Actually, so he sh yeah, Gar don't use Garboder. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, thank goodness this NPC switched. Ah, Raichu! I think it's a female Raichu, according to the tail. It's not spiky. It's not, it's not, it doesn't have that pent, that point. So it's female. Chill says just be Super Metroid this morning. I'm looking forward to streaming Fusion. Ah! Have a chance. Metro Fusion still on the Wii U? Dang. Jolene says the closest thing to a 3D Kirby game is Super Kirby 64, MR 64, ROM hack. Oh, when you play as Kirby? Oh, okay, okay. Placina, you want me to switch? I mean, I don't have any super effective damage or resistances to uh, Necrozma, so I don't mind switching. It's just I don't want to. I don't want to be that guy that keeps taking Pokemon. You know, like if someone else really needs it. So <laughs> I just don't want to be that guy. JS. Merge wants the next Minecraft stream. You are kid You are kidnapped villagers? Oh my gosh. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I'll continue streaming Minecraft. Thing is, not many people watch it. Same with Fantasy Star Online 2. I would like to stream Fantasy Star Online 2. Um do the dailies and I guess do laboratory ruins but it's just not a not a thing not a game people want to watch Christina says Necrozma has electric attack against Sharpedo and they raise special attack yeah charge beam it raises the user special attack Darkling? Uh, Miitopia? I don't know if it's the same nowadays. The thing is, Miitopia? I mean, Miitopia was new back then, but I don't think... It, it, 
I don't think I would get the same views on the Metopia stream nowadays. Chill says we also have zero mission, other M and Prime Trilogy, all of which the Switch Ultimate doesn't have. Yeah, uh, Wii U has its own virtual console. It's amazing. It's too bad the Switch doesn't have any of the uh, virtual console. <laughs> Darkness is Skyward Sword. Julia, you don't like Skyward Sword? I never played it, so I I don't know. I can't. I don't have. I can't say anything about it. But from what I heard, the the Switch port of Skyward Sword fixed a lot of well, a lot of annoying issues. Especially they it, a bunch of. They cut out a lot of filler, a lot of time wasters, like dialogue. From what I've heard. Dang, I mean, Lucario and I took some damage. Um. Um, well, look, uh, I'll take it. Uh, Sharpedo, I assume, has crunch or bite. It's a dark move against Necrozma Psychic. It's super effective, so. And, you know, Sharpedo's immune to Psychic, with Raichu having Lightning Rod to protect Sharpedo. So it's like Sharpedo can, is immune to two attacks, at least, from Necrozma. Wait, where are we going? Is that Bolton? That's Phalanx. I don't really want to do that. Oh, Item Lady! But berries! Oh, oh. Berries or Item Lady? Oh, man, I don't know. Oh, Assurance, okay. Dang, then Lucario won't get healed. But then again, at least we'll all equip ourselves with some items to help us. Well, then again, maybe Lucario might find a citrus berry. I don't know. Julian says Link's design is terrifying in Skyward Sword. Oh! I'm not a fan of it either. Speed swap. Um, I assume Bolton is faster than Raichu. Anyway, uh, why? I guess I'm not gonna bother you. Well, I mean, I <laughs> we're all protected against electrics. I don't think I even need to, what. I don't think Bolton even. What other attacks does even, Bolton even have? Any other special attacks other than electric attacks? I just use Focus Blast. I mean, I'm not gonna use Focus Blast on Necrozma. But I might as well use it now on, on Bolton. Nice. Nice. Focus blast. Ah! Epic fail. I missed. <laughs> focus miss. Get it? Focus. Yeah. Does anyone else call it focus miss? It's kind of a nickname I've heard years ago. Years ago, I heard of the term focus miss. I'm like, dude, that's people should rename focus blast to focus miss. <laughs> Uh, Jillian says, Jillian says, I only hate Skyward Sword because the forced motion controls and the new design for both Link and Zelda's design. Oh yeah, motion controls. I'm not a fan of that either. Definitely to Swift. Oh, Bolton knows Swift? Ow. Dang. Should probably use light speed. Focus blast! It worked. <laughs> oh, Mr. Mom used light screen. Never mind. I don't have to use light screen. Bolton us crunch. Oh. oh no. Oh no. Um, does anyone even have any ground attacks? I doubt it. I guess I might as well Dynamax. I can use Focus Blast. I did get a I did get a special attack boost from being hit by electric, so I think I'm gonna do that. Scholar says 
Uh, motion controls are optional in a, in the port, Switch port. Yes, yes they are. Nintendo released a video um, showcasing like how you how it works with the because there's no motion control. Because with motion control you can a like angle how you slash, but now you use the stick to angle how you want to slash. That sounds kind of. I don't know. Can you? I don't know if I can. I don't know. <laughs> Angling how you want to slash using the stick. But wait, use the, you usually in gaming, right? In a 3D environment, you use the the left stick to move your character and the right stick to rotate the camera. But if you use the right stick to slash, how do you move the camera? Unless you press one of the triggers to put the camera behind you. But it's like I don't know. Seems kind of a hassle. You move the cam by holding the trigger and moving the stick. Oh, clever. Nintendo, Nintendo thinks of everything. They're clever. Except online. Then they're not. They're not clever in that in that realm. <laughs> in the online realm. <laughs> Lucara says I take. I don't know, either you or Blastina, some well uh, Well No. No. I think Blastina should take it. Keep keep your Sharpedo because at least you're a dark type, sir, so you're immune to wait, what happened? Okay. At least you get speed boosts, free speed boost, and you're you're immune to psychic. So, honestly, leftovers. It's like, why even bother? Legendary's gonna hit so hard, but I like surviving. So, <laughs> I like to live. Yes, I like not dying. <laughs> Chill says SSH uh, Skyward Sword HD has free motion camera by holding. Oh yeah, what that Sky said. Was it says let's sell that live stream first? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Why do I says be waiting for Mario Boxing Revenge of Wario? Oh my gosh. Why do I? You're silly. Lucar says. But I like surviving, so. <laughs> that is so true. My gosh, Nizo is here. What? Plot twist. The twist has been plotted. Get it? Uh, Chill says the only good Wii U ports on Switch right now are Smash Bros. and Animal Crossing. Oh my gosh. Haha. <laughs> funny. Why are you so funny, Chill? You're so funny. Nizo says the unfortunate mistake is that choice is I don't have... I don't know where my Switch charger is and it's dead? Oh gosh. Your Switch is dead? Oh man, you can't find the charger, that's crazy. That's crazy. I'm not gonna speed swap because I'm pretty sure my right is faster. Go guys, tries his best. The Shadow Sneak, not very sneaky though. Top 5 uh, Nintendo Switch games. Jillian says, mine are Luigi's Mansion 3, Zelda Breath of the Wild, More Crazy Lux, Mario Odyssey, Slash Mario 3D World Plus Bowser's Fury. Wait, wait a minute. You combined Mario Odyssey with Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury in the no your number two slot? Wait, in the number two slot? Can we really do that? Is it really top five Switch games if you put two games in the second slot? Wait a minute. 
I, I mm, you seem kind of sus there. <laughs> Never want to smash though. No complaints here. <laughs> Scholar says you really putting my car over Breath of Wild. Shake my head. <laughs> I wouldn't... Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, I love it a lot, but I, I don't think I'd put it in my top 5 Switch games, because... I mean, it's a port of the Wii U. I, I played... I it, Man, if I had like a top 5 Wii U games, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe would go there. But on the Switch... I guess it's because I played a lot of Mario Kart 8 on the Wii U that it's... I don't favor it so highly on the Switch. I already put a lot of time into it on Wii U. Great game. Highly recommend it to anyone. Nah, Darkling, you're free. What? Free from the Shuttle Realm? What? Plot twist. Free from the void <laughs> in which you took a picture of your shiny Phoebus in? <laughs> no, wait, you are the void. You live in the void. Wait a minute, what am I saying? You are the darkness. Oh my gosh, Eli. It has been a while. Scholar says, why even put Mario Kart in the top five? It's just a port from the Wii U. I mean, it's technically a Switch game. I mean, it's a port from the Wii U, but it's, it's on the Switch, so I... I mean, it's, there's no rules. I, I, That's fine with me, anyway. It just wouldn't be on my top five. Because I, I played so much of it on Wii U. I don't know if I even have a top five. Switch, uh, Nintendo Switch games. You know what? I think I do, but I just don't know what order I should put it. It's, it's hard. Smash Ultimate, though, is on my top five for sure. Pokemon Home would be on my top five. <laughs> Does that count? YouTube would be on my top five Switch games. <laughs> Apparently, it's on a lot of people's uh, profiles, like from what I Switch profiles from what I've seen. It's, it's a popular game, I hear. <laughs> That's not shiny. No luck. I don't think that's shiny. Shiny Bolton is a bit blue, right? Yeah, no. I just want to make sure. I already have a shiny Gore guys. I'd be I'd be pretty mad if I got a shiny Gore guys because I already wait. Do I have one? Wait a minute. Do I not? Wait. I I don't know. No, I do have one. I think. We'll see, this is going to charge, charge my battery. Okay. Why do I says people when game released? Yawn. But then people win a new port for a new console. Whoa! <laughs> my gosh. Darkling says, I mean, in terms of game, Mario Kart is popular on Switch. Yeah, definitely. Isn't it like the most, the highest selling Switch game sold, right? It's Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. But see, not many, not many, there weren't that many Switch, there weren't that many Wii U owners, it, which is unfortunate why all those Wii U games just didn't make enough money. Because there are some good Wii U games, but thankfully they're getting, they're given a second chance on the Switch. Now people can truly experience those great Wii U games. Again, I highly recommend Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, great game. Ult uh, Scholar's Ultimate, uh, Smash Ultimate made Shovel Knight and Assist, only zero stars, oh my gosh. Oh, uh, Sukite Sukiteo? How does that name sound so familiar? You sound familiar. Where have I heard that, that name? Chill says NES Tennis is my number one favorite Switch game of all time, oh my gosh. Get out of here, chills. <laughs> what even? 
No shiny Lucario? Darn. I mean, Lucario saying no shiny. Not, not, not that. Not that looking for a shiny Lucario. Chill says Star Fox Zero is an excellent Wii U game that all Switch owners sh should play via our new port released in Never. I've heard, man, Star Fox Zero, I've heard bad reviews on that game, which is kind of surprising for e for a first party Nintendo game to even have bad reputation. But, I mean, from what I've seen, Star Fox Zero, you gotta use the gamepad as well, like both gamepad and the screen at the same time, moving your head up and down, like what the heck? I don't know what Nintendo was thinking. I don't know how you would even change, like, readjust the game for the Switch, which only uses one screen. I never played Star Fox Zero, so I don't, I really, really wouldn't really know. Chill says it got bad reviews because Miyamoto wants to make things unique. Yeah, see, that's... That, if that's always, there's always a balance when making a sequel to a game, or a reboot, is that, you know, you don't want to do the same thing over and over, but I mean... I mean, on paper, it makes sense, right? If a person, if, if a game is popular, you want the sequel to be... I mean, if it worked the first time, why change it? If it ain't broke, don't fix for the sequel. At the same time, then people will complain, this feels like the same, the first game. But it's like, that's what people like the first game to begin with. But I mean, yeah, spice things up, but like, don't change things too far where people are like, what are you even doing? <laughs> That's just, but I mean, when you gotta use two screens to play a game, come on, man. It sucks when Nintendo uses their niche feature on the console to, on their new release, like, for example, the Wii, right, has motion controls. Well, now Nintendo is putting motion controls in their Wii games. Now with the Wii U, well, back then, so the, then, the Wii U, having a gamepad, second screen, now they want to do that with all their Wii U games. Thankfully, the Switch doesn't have, the it, the Switch's niche isn't something that you can change, like, gameplay. It doesn't jeopardize the gameplay, thankfully. Oh yeah, Star Fox Guard, I forgot about that. Forgot that was a thing. Alright, so, Lucario, are you still there? Do you want to do Latios? Nova says I was terrible at Star Fox. I think it was on GameCube. Do not get on the, in a plane with me as a pilot. St you, I, GameCube? Are you talking about Star Fox Adventures? Wasn't that a whole different genre? That's when that's when Fox walks around on a dinosaur planet, right? I never played that game. Yeah, Darkling, anyone can join. Lucario is hosting. First come, first serve. Hopefully I get in. Nova says maybe it was Nintendo 64. Yeah. I've heard great things about that game. I never played Star... I I've never played any Star Fox game. Star Fox 64 was on Nintendo 64? Yes. Yes. Thank you, Chills, for clarifying. <laughs> that makes too much sense. Nita says, I'd pop in to one, but... I still need to charge my Switch now that I found the charger a couple minutes ago. Oh, okay. Ah, Julian, you scared me. Uh, Jolene says, can we talk about how Smash Bros. sold 22 million plus units in three years while Animal Crossing sold 32 million plus copies in less than one and a half years? Yeah, one word. Pandemic. There. <laughs> That's why. That's why. All I'm going to say is Animal Crossing got the perfect timing to release right at the beginning of the pandemic. Everyone stayed indoors. Hey, I can make my own tropical island paradise. Yeah, perfect timing for Animal Crossing. Also, you know, Smash Bros being a fighting game. 
I mean, fighting games, I mean, in the grand scheme of things, if you think about every fighting game to exist, f how many copies they sell, I don't know, does it, does it feel like, I don't know, it, fighting games, how often, like, is there a different miles, a different, different milestone of, like, profits that people would expect when selling a fighting game? Because, I mean, the, a the, the, the average gamer, would they rather buy a fighting game or, I don't know, play Candy Crush? I don't know, it's like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm not in the room. What? You're right, I'm not in the room. What's going on here? Is it one a uh, zero one two seven, right? Or did I get it wrong? Zero one two seven twice. But I What? How did I not find you guys? That's weird. Wait, am I online? I know I was just online with you guys. Yeah, no, yeah, I am. Local, okay. That's weird. Oh, you accidentally exited? Oh, okay. Gotcha. Skylar says, I wish Paper Mario... Wait, hold on. Let me, uh... Ah, gotta hurry. Why do I say, hey, Urge, can you spin? What? No. I'll get dizzy and then vomit. <laughs> I get dizzy very easy when I spin. It's very uncomfortable. So, wait, what was... Okay, so Skylar said, I wish Paper Mario can combine the paper theming and gimmicks from Origami King and Color Splash and the traditional RPG game from the first two games. I'm, I'm going to be real with you. I never played any Paper Mario game. I've heard Thousand Year Door is the best of them all. And ever since then, Paper Mario has not been the same. It's been downhill. That's that's all I've heard on the internets. Hasn't been the same. Urge vomit on stream. <laughs> I mean, when I get dizzy, uh, yeah, I may vomit. <laughs> Skylar says, don't worry, I never played one too. Oh. Does anyone else want to join? Uh, this is... Uh, this is to fight Latios, by the way. If anyone is interested in joining. That shiny Latios, though. I don't have shiny Latios. I have shiny Latios from Pokemon Go, but I never got a shiny Latios, so... I'm gonna throw a Premier Bowl at the at the Latios because my Latias, shiny Latias from Pokemon Go is, is calling a Premier Bowl, of course, because it's, it's, it's from a raid. Darkling says I have both from Pokemon Go, so dang! That flex though, Darkling. <laughs> Chill says I hear Paper, Super Paper Mario was okay, but the story saved it. Other games. Uh, after it went truly downhill. Ah, okay. I don't know. I don't really have much else to say about Paper Mario. Because I never played them. So I I feel like I don't, I don't have... Uh, I don't really have an opinion on it. I wouldn't really know what to say. Nizo says, Nizo, Nizo says I could spend a certain amount of times... As I, uh, as I only get the kick from it after I stop. Oh, okay. Darkling says, my my father gave me shiny Reg Regigigas from Pokemon Go. Oh. I have a 100% regular uh, Regigigas. It was when it was first released. You had to buy that pass. It was when they first released Regigigas on the special research that you had to buy for a couple bucks. And I was like, ooh, guaranteed... Legendary, because then it was gonna come out on EX raids, and I'm like, dude, I can't, I can't keep up with EX raids. Um, Blizzard though. Yes.
Why do I says, what do you think of Wario and Waluigi? Uh... <laughs> they should get their own game together. Well, first, Waluigi should get its own game. And then there should be a collab, a collaboration game with Wal Waluigi and Wario. They need their own game. I know Wario, he already has his own game. Wario Land and WarioWare, and it's like, dude, where's the Waluigi love? Anyway, uh, um, I, oh, is that Crocodile? On, on the right side. Or Crocorock. I don't know which one is, couldn't tell. But yeah, Crocodile or Crocorock, it's a dark type, so that's a good one. We should go after that. Chills of the Dream Team is underrated. Jack says, sadly, I can't join. I use shield and don't have the pass. Oh, okay. Why do I say sorry? I meant Mario and Luigi series. Oh, dang. Oh, gosh. I don't want to use up blizzards on... I want to save blizzard for Latios. Oh, gosh. Hyper beam? I'll use one. If I miss, I'm going to be sad. But Mario and Luigi? Oh gosh, Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga on the Game Boy Advance. Love it. Love the game. Love the music. Love the final boss music. I looked at, so I, di I didn't get the remake on 3DS. I looked up some of the music uh, on, on the 3DS version, right? On YouTube. Uh, I especially looked, I, I, I took a listen to the final battle, final boss battle with Peck Letta on the 3DS. Because I want to hear how, like, I was hoping the music would be better, but I don't like the music. That really bummed me out. They messed up the music on that final battle. I, I Google search a video watching the final battle, how it went, because... The really awesome thing I love about fighting Kakleta, the final fight, is you're down to 1 HP, right? <laughs> and you gotta survive. A Kakleta is, is, is doing a throwing attacks at you. You have to dodge it or block it or else you die. Then you can heal. But they, I forgot, they, just, they changed it. You can, either you don't, I don't, Wait, I don't think. Do you serve? Does the battle start with one HP or no? Or you can use healing items first before Kakaleta attacks. I don't. I forgot what happened, but they made it easy by doing that. Whatever they did, they made it easier. I'm like, dude, what? I don't want to use Blizzard. I'll use Hyper Beam. I know it's terrible because I'll charge. I'm going to waste another turn, but. Uh, but um. Yeah, Superstar Saga, I love. What was the next one? Partners in Time. I love that game. I, I also beat that game, too. Funny enough, Partners in Time, I bought it used at GameStop. This was years ago, by the way. Like, I just, I bought it used. I played through the whole game. I beat the game in, like, two days. And then I returned it with the receipt to get my money back. <laughs> Uh, I, I just, I didn't say, there was nothing wrong with it, it's just, I, I, I told them at GameStop, like, I just want to return it. I don't need to give a reason. Got the receipt. Return it. It was a fun game. But I didn't, I didn't play any other Mario and Luigi games after that. I liked it. All the other Mario and Luigi games, I haven't played them just because I didn't have the money to buy them. Hi, Toasty. Toasty, do you still play PSO2? Why do I say I know, I know why you like it? It's got the Mario Bros. I mean... I like Mario and Luigi in general, but that doesn't mean I'll play every game that they're in. Like, for example, Mario Golf. I did not get that game on the Switch. I'm still kinda... I'm still salty about Mario Golf's existence. Because, because of its existence, a new Golden Sun game from the devs, Camelot, does not exist. And I'm like, dang, if only, if only, 
If only. <laughs> Toasty says, kinda, why? I'm just asking, because I still play it. I do the dailies every day. On PSO2. Alright, where are we going? Oh, yeah! Who's up here, anyway? Ooh, fairy. But that's Whimsicott. Wait a minute, Whimsicott! Oh my gosh, why do I? <laughs> why do I say true gamer? Only a true gamer would beat the game in two days and then return it. <laughs> Wait, Lucario says, if you could have a Pokemon with any type combination of types, what would it be? Just something I thought of. Huh. Does it have to not exist? Um, what hasn't been done? Um, well, I, uh, Psychic is my favorite typing, so Psychic would be one of them, but Psychic and Dark, that's Malamar. Is there Psychic and Ghost type? Psychic and Ghost. Is anyone that typing? Huh. Darkling says use Terrain Pulse next turn. Okay, I will. Needzo says, oh, Hoopa? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, Hoopa's Ghost and, and um, Psychic, okay. Isn't Ghost normal game? Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's weird. That's a weird combination, Ghost and normal type. Is it, so I thought, yeah, regular Hoopa is Psychic and Ghost, but isn't Unbound form Hoopa Psychic and Dark? Does it change does it change its typing? Oh, Toasty, what do I think of your latest drawing? It was a female character, right? I figured that was from PSO 2, judging by the clothing. I don't know. It looks cool. I don't know who that person is. Is that one of your friends? Although I must say, the thigh looks kind of weird. The thigh looks bent. Because your drawing, it has a female character sitting, right? But... Like, from the butt cheek to the, like, the thigh? It's... it's weird. It looks really bent. It's, it's weird. But Nizo, you want another Steel Dragon? I wouldn't mind that as well. Steel Dragon, like, it's only Dalga and Duraludon, right? When I think of a Steel Dragon, I think of the blue eyes white dragon from Yu-Gi-Oh! Or, like, <laughs> it's just, uh, I feel like Yu-Gi-Oh! has cooler dragons wearing armor, and it's like, that's what I think of when I, when I think of steel and dragon types. Red Eyes Metal Dragon? <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't play, uh, I, I just, I, I used, I only watched the Yu-Gi-Oh! anime. I don't, I don't, I don't collect the cards, I never did. I played one Yu-Gi-Oh! video game on GameCube. But, uh, I don't have much knowledge about Yu-Gi-Oh! French. Who's, who's grabbing this crocodile though? Me! Darkest Lariat. Yeah. I don't know Crocodile can learn that. Fairy? Item Lady!
Oh my gosh, Julian. Oh, you've been playing that Friday night game? Toasty says it's a weird it's a weird perspective, that's why it's bent a little. Yeah, I think it's just bent too much. Darkly says that is from the anime. What? I only remember Joey Wheeler's Red Eyes Black Dragon. Not Metal Dragon. Or is it called Red Eyes Metal Dragon? I thought Joey Wheeler had a Red Eyes Black Dragon. Wasn't it called that? I, I just don't. Well, I don't remember the Metal Dragon. I stopped. Like, I, when Yu Gi Oh! GX. I, I stopped watching when GX started. Like, I just was interested in, in the Pharaoh. Um, gosh, what do I even go with anymore? I don't know. <laughs> it's it's fairy and grass, like sure. Red eyes and metamorph, metal morph. Oh, okay. He just says all you need to kill Geraldon is a special attack with a not with a Pokemon with a decent special attack stat. Ah, okay. I, I I don't I don't know about Geraldon's base stats. I don't know anything about it. All I know is Geraldon is just not the kind of steel dragon I care to train. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> only well, has 50 in special defense. Dang, really. <laughs> why do I just watch that cop I look at people's souls? Ugh. True. Now what do you think you think of still a dragon? I don't know special defense. That's true. Dalga says, did you forget Dalga? No, I, I mentioned Dalga and uh, Duraldon when we first started the conversation about stealing dragons. Dalga! Dalga! Like, when I think of dragons, I think of... I think of... It has wings. Dialga... Doesn't have wings. I mean, it has like a tail wing fin thing. <laughs> has that going for it. Nizo says my only issue with it is that Dialga is an uber tier. Oh, being a legendary Pokemon. Ah. Oh, Julian, okay. Um I never see I never played Friday night. I I so I don't Is this by the Sky Devil? Okay, I not familiar with that. Sorry. <clears throat> Hi, Nightmare Stream. What are we talking about? We're talking about Steel and Dragon Pokemon. Uh, the, how they look. <laughs> how there, are, there there needs to be more. <laughs> I was saying Steel and Dragon type. So Dalga and Drelodon. Those are the only two in the, in the game. But when I think of Steel and Dragon, I think of like Yu-Gi-Oh monsters, like a, a dragon wearing metallic armor, and I'm like, these steel dragon types in, in Pokemon, it's not what I imagine a steel and dragon type would be. He just says it's amazing stats and typing, but not the tier to use, at least that I play in. Ah, oh, okay. Electric Dragon! Is it only Zekrom? Who else? Is Zekrom the only... Electric Dragon? I don't, I don't... I don't... Huh. Um... I'm not grabbing this. Oh, good! The NPC... Wait, no! Uh, actually, yeah, okay, cool. Wait, what? 
Doesn't... I don't know. Does the Jigglypuff have Sing? <laughs> I don't know. I will grab a Citrus Berry. Because I like surviving. Chill says Corrin from Smash Bros. and not Fire Emblem. Doobie Dalga from Pokemon. Oh, gosh. I know, right? <laughs> it does. It does look like Dalga. And that has wings. Also, Mega Ampharos. Ah, you're right. It does exist. Oh, you have to look it up? Ah, okay. Man, I wish Megas would come back. I hope it comes back someday in the future. Future mainline Pokemon game. Lucario says there's no fairy slash fighting. Huh. I think you're right. I don't think there is a fairy slash fighting. Should I do Swagger? I don't... Does Latios even have any physical attacks? I don't even know. I'm just gonna use Darkest Lariat. Darkling says I was about to say Grass Dragon. Yeah, Mega Sceptile exists. Hi, Nintenpat! Nintenpat says rumors are... In the new Gen 4 games, they might return. Rumor? I wonder where these rumors even come from. I mean, I can... I'll cross my fingers and hope for the best. I am. Mean, I that would be great if that rumor is true. That would be fantastic. Because then my Mega Gardevoir can come back. Yes. Yeah. Why do I says you think you're cool? I horn drill the Dynamax Pokemon. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, is that possible? Wait, you can do that on a Dynamax What? Like horn drill, fissure, sheer cold? Does that work on a Dynamax Pokemon? What? Wait, are we talking about raids or like online battles? <laughs> Oh, this is half health? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, that reminds me. Dang. I still... I still want that mod champ with no guard fissure. Chills. Are you trading? Is Chills even here? I don't know if he's even here. Yeah, I want that no guard fissure my champ from Pokemon Yellow. All right, so her mirror ball. Come on, shiny. Oh, hi, chills. We were just talking about you saying how how cool you are. Get it? Because your name's Chills. Chills says I need to get Pokemon Bank to transfer it po oh, to Pokemon Home, which I don't have. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Moment of truth. Da, dang. No shiny. That's what is she not a shiny even? I don't even know what. That ah, doesn't look shiny. That's the same. I don't even know what a shiny shinotic would look like. But uh, chills. I mean, if you want, you could trade me that mod champ on 3DS, and then I could transfer it to home for you, and then give it back to you. No thanks. Not gonna keep that one. Shiny Shinotic is the color of mushroom. <laughs> I mean, I, uh, 
Oh, okay. Kinda wish it wasn't the color of mushrooms. <laughs> Kinda wish it was uh, something else, I don't know. No shiny Lucario? Dang. No shiny Darkling? Okay. Um... Alright, how about we do Stack Attacka? I have Stack Attacka. Stack Attacka! Or Tapu Lele? Ah. Stack Attacka. I want those that, that those golden bricks. <laughs> those golden bricks, though. <laughs> You'll pass? Okay. And Tempest says, maybe I should put my own Pokemon Sword back. Try to get the shiny Ice Bird thing. Oh, Carson, what? Dang. Oh, the Golden Brick was your second legendary? Dang, lucky. <laughs> if anyone wants to join, uh, the code is right there. Seven eight two three seven eight two three. Oh, why do I? <laughs> oh, I see. Why do I? Oh, you were just lying. Clever. Julian says last message. Your last message is last message. So then the last message of that last message is your profile picture got possessed by the sky devil. Hey, right, I no, the devil sky. Right. I I already read that. I'm not familiar with that, I said. I don't know who that is. Does anyone else like to join? Ardu? What? Really? <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> Plot twist, it was just me. Is Psychopath here? Psychopath, where are you? Ah. Julian, I don't see it then. Lucario asks, is stock, stack attack a rock steel? Y yeah, isn't it? Isn't it? Is it? I think so. Yeah, isn't it a rock and steel type? Ah! Shadow Kitty. Plot twist. Shadow Kitty is here. And Shadow Kitty is part Marshadow. <laughs> part Marshadow and part Sonic. Ah, okay. Thank you, Nizo. Lucario says, any weaknesses? Well, it's four times weak to fighting, that's for sure. Weak to, um... Four times weak to, to ground. This is crazy! Two grounds! Wow! Yes, please. Uh, I'm gonna pick Doug Trio because he's fast. Someone needs to pick Stunfisk. Yeah, water is two times weak. Shadow Kitty says, I'm, I'm surprised you're back to playing Pokemon. Yeah. Actually, Jay, do you play Pokemon Go? Dang, Lucario chose Flareon. I know there weren't anything else to choose from, but like... Uh, Lucario's gotta switch out that Pokemon for something, eventually. Oh, I see Shadow Kitty, okay. It is only weak to special attack ground. 
Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, Stock Attack has a lot of physical defense. Santa Conda's right there. Water, electric, poison, dark, grass, water. Can't tell who that is. Looks like, is it Lantern? No, it's not Lantern. It almost, it almost looks like Relicanth. Between Relicanth and Lantern, I don't know. Some, it's a fish. Oh, Relicanth. I, you know what? It just dawned on me. Relicanth, isn't it? It's... It's supposed to be the Pokemon version of the Colacanth, right? Remember Animal Crossing? You can catch that Colacanth. It's a rare, rare fish. Ancient fish. Do you even call it Colacanth or is it Solacanth? I don't know. Chill says I need about 200 spirits to complete the spirit collection in Smash Bros. I need one more spirit to complete the collection. Uh, so I got the three new spirits that are that's going on right now in Smash Bros. I got those three new spirits. But I don't have the Monster Hunter spirit. You need Monster Hunter stories save data, right? Wait, is the demo count? Wait a minute. Or do you need the actual game? Shut up, Kitty. You love Monster Hunter? I have Monster Hunter Worlds on, on PC, on Steam. I love that game. You haven't touched Kazuya yet? Dang. It's working as AoE attack. Shadow Kitty says Kazuya is too broken. <laughs> Julian asks Chills, which spirits do you are you missing? I don't know if he's gonna list all 200 spirits he's missing. Julian says only have the Fury Bowser spirit missing. It's so hard. Oh, okay. I was able to beat that spirit just by well, cause. The spirit I use equipped, I always use Giratina with, with the Golden Mario, which gives me super armor. And I was just wailing on that Bowser. Wait, isn't that Bowser? Is that a fiery floor? I forgot. Julian says he kills me in one hit with super armor. What? One hit? Wait, what? He one shots you? Really? Uh, huh. Why do I say Nintendo games be like release DLC three to five months after the game releases? And then don't update, oh my gosh. <laughs> Nidza says, in fact, today's the first day in the month that I've touched my Switch at all. Dang. So Nidza, what game have you been playing? No drawbacks, just super armor? That's true. Um I mean water. And then we can go to ground. Nisa says Stock Attacka is only weak for four times ground and steel, and then two times weak to water. Yep, so Mantine's right here. I'm gonna stick with Doug Trio. Hi, Kevin Paul. Yeah, chills. Um, Gold Mario is a good spirit. Like the well, the only drawback I'd say is it takes up all three slots. But I mean, hey. I, I think it's well worth it.
Oh my gosh, Shadow Kitty. Your Shadow Kitty says my favorite spirit is Meta Knight that has wings, holds a sword, which increases weapon. Ah. Isn't that the Galacta Knight, too? Uh, Julian says, I mean, I do play Mithra and Kirby, who are lighter side, but even my Ridley, Mario, and Samus get up, smash, 1KO. Really? One hit? I- oh, jeez. Oh, no, Stunfisk. I don't remember Fury Bowser being that hard of a spirit to defeat. Huh. Why do I just imagine a fighter and smash? <laughs> That has a fighter spirit and a normal spirit? Oh wait, jeez. Isn't that Midman? Chido Kitty says we only have one final uh, Smash Bros. Char character DLC reveal. Yeah, I still... I still want a Fantasy Star character or Master Chief in Smash. I honestly don't know who it's gonna be. No one knows. This is bad. That was a critical hit? What? What? Mantine avoided the... the attack from Relicamp! What? Are you serious? Here's the thing, the rain is powering up Mantine's water attack, so... This is scary. This is scary. Shadow Kitty asks, do you like Kingdom Hearts, Urge? I do! Yeah. I've played Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, Chain of Memories on Game Boy Advance, and then Chain of, and read Chain of Memories on the PS2. Uh, Birth by Sleep on PSP. I played 351 slash 2 days. Okay, I don't know the number exactly. <laughs> I have that on DS. Let me catch this. I, have, I also have Kingdom Hearts 3. I never played um, Kingdom Hearts Recoded. So... I know that was on mobile, and then it, it, and then that that went on DS, right? It was a 3DS. I know there's a Kingdom Hearts 3DS, but I never Dream Drop Distance. I never played that game. I was like, eh, eh. I I didn't play Recoded or Dream Drop Distance because it just seemed like they're just reusing assets, milking the game. I just want Kingdom Hearts 3 already, kind of thing, you know? I was like. Eh. <laughs> Alright, bye, why do I? Kevin Paul says I love Pokemon cards. Ah, me too. Well, I don't... I haven't been collecting... Wait, hold on. Uh, ground. Oh, and berries! Nice. I haven't been... Gosh. I have not obtained a real-life Pokemon card for many years. I still play, I like playing Pokemon cards right now in Tabletop Simulator on Steam using the Pokemon card mod, which has every Pokemon card in existence in that. I used to play the Pokemon TCG online back in 2015, but it just got too costly to keep up with the cards. Well that, cause like, it takes so long to get cards if you're free to play. I hope Doug Trey doesn't, uh... You know what? Muscle lowers accuracy, right? Yeah, it does. It's very weak, though. I'm gonna use Mud Slap to lower its accuracy. No, it says it's nearly impossible. Yeah. Nito says, We fit balance board would be funny. If it was the last DLC. Oh my gosh. I don't know about that. I don't know. 
Kevin Paul asked, do you play Zelda? Well, I mean, I've played so much Breath of the Wild. I've, um, I've played Minish Cap on Game Boy Advance. I, I love Zelda Four Sword Adventure on GameCube. I still have the game. Love it. I love Triforce Heroes on the 3DS. I never did got to 100% that game. Though. I didn't get all the outfits, but I love that game. I love the online Zelda games. Um, I like Link to the Past. I never had Link to the Past on Super, uh, Super Nintendo. I got Link to the Past when it came out on Game Boy Advance, which also came with Legend of Zelda Four Sword. Not Four Sword Adventure, but just Four Sword. I think that was its first appearance, wasn't it? Toon Link? Wasn't that when Toon Link made its first appearance? I don't know. It was new for me. I was like, what is this? Online? No, not online, but multiplayer Zelda. What? And so, I remember I bought the Link Cable for four Game Boy Advances, right? And all, was it? Did we have four people? Maybe it was only three or two. Um, the, the problem was all four people needed the cartridge. That was hard to find people. So, oh yeah, Wind Waker, duh. I don't know why, I, just, I completely forgot Wind Waker existed. Yeah, I played Wind, Wind Waker as well, although I didn't get to finish it. I remember back then, I borrowed Wind Waker from a friend. Um, I explored a lot. I don't know how far I got, but I had to give it back because my friend was moving away. So. I mean, I've never played Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, which I feel like people will just <laughs> will just scream at me for saying, WHAT?! WHAT?! <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Who are you, really? <laughs> you're too kind, Shadow Kitty. Wait, Shadow Kitty, you're on YouTube now, plot twist. Jill says, I used to play Pokemon cards like crazy for a couple years, then it got too expensive. Yeah. I like playing the Pokemon cards, like the card game. It's funny. I remember when Pokemon card, like when the, when the whole Pokemon craze in the late 90s happened. Um. Wait. Should I grab it? Is anyone grabbing it? I'll grab it. Lucario's passing on that, so I'll grab it. I know there are berries at the end, but like, I, I, Doug Trio, the only thing it has going for it is incredible speed. It's high status speed, but like, it's a it's damage, it's attack, it's not not so amazing. So I'm hoping Santa Cobra had, can do more damage than Doug Trio. Cause that attack is just really slow, you know. I'm going to assume my my uh my my Pokemon is faster than Stack Attacka. And plus Scorch Scorching Sands can burn. So that's really good. That wide guard though. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Should I could says fire ground fighting weakness? Fire? No, fight. Fire? Wait, what? Stack attack is rock and steel, though. Fire, it's, it's not weak to it. But it's burnt, though! Yes! Yes! Nintendo Pat, Ice Bird? Are you talking about Articuno? I, I already have a shiny Articuno. I caught it in Pokemon Go. Uh, 
Uh, I also have a shiny Zapdos from Pokemon Go. And did I ever catch a shiny Moltres? I think I did. It's always weird to me, Stack Attacka, when he when you see underneath his body, it's there's like nothing inside. I mean, it's an empty room. It's just weird. Stack Attack. Stack Attack is a weird. I know it's an Ultra Beast. They're all weird. I don't know. It's just. I don't know. <laughs> weird concept. Dang, we just destroyed this guy. Shadow Kitty says, I remember caught a couple shinies in Pokemon Go. I was I played in I played Pokemon Go Fest of, um, on Saturday. They released Meloetta. I'm really happy about that. And uh, in, what is it? I was hoping, during the GoFest last Saturday, I was hoping to get a shiny Gardevoir with a hat, Meloetta's hat, but no, it never happened. I caught two Gardevoirs with a special, <gasps> with a special hat, but they weren't shiny. And they weren't 100% IVs either. That was too bad. Darn, no shiny. I don't even, I don't know what a shandy, a sandy, um, a, a shiny Sandaconda it looks like. That's not shiny though. Needs says I currently have Kyogre, Stack Attack, and Necrozma for my routes. Really? Stack, you have Stack Attack too? You're hunting it. Oh. Oh, gray color? Oh, really dark one. Oh, okay. You still want your Jenga? <laughs> that, that is so true. The Tempest is doing a challenge and something shield to get all the damn legendary shiny uh, in Pokedex order. Dang. Well, good luck to that. <laughs> I'm not... There's only a certain Pokemon I'm going for. I'm only going for Pokemon that I don't have a shiny of. So. But, but see, that's also including... That's also including shiny Pokemon I've caught in Pokemon Go or in past games. Because I caught it. Lucario, no shiny? Darn. Lestina, I must decline. Good to see you, though. Mmm, chills. Uh, I don't know. Here's the thing. I'm not sure if... My, so, my streaming schedule... So, I wiped, I, I deleted my streaming, when I took this break from streaming, I deleted all s stream schedules for my Twitch and on the, like, the Discord rules. Um, yeah, it, I don't, today is, I, I don't know if I'll be streaming on Mondays. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I think this this will conclude my stream for today. Yeah, this will conclude my stream for today. Shadow Kitty, you're gonna eat rice with orange chicken. Bye and take care. Goodbye, Shadow Kitty. Do you have any shinies to trade? <laughs> I'm like, wait, Shadow Kitty, wait a minute. Shinies? Nah, oh, never mind, never mind. <laughs> Blastina, what do you mean? Darkling says Niza just logged in. Oh, into Pokemon? Niza says just popping to say hi.
Um, who's Jeffrey? Lucina Palkia. I already have a shiny Palkia, though. Not really interested. There's Needzo. Come to think of it, how many... Oops, how many, uh... Is 999 the max, or can it go... Can it surpass a thousand? I better spend this. Let's see, so what about Buzzwall? Oh, that'd be pretty cool. I don't have a uh, shiny Buzzwall. I don't... Wait. Do I have any... I think the only shiny Ultra Beast I have... Don't I have a... It's been a while. Wait, shiny Faramosa, right? No? That's mine I EV trained myself. Don't I have a shiny Faramosa? No, wait, what do you even be listed here? Hold on, hold on. Shiny... I guess not. I thought I had one. There it is. Oh, but wait a minute. Oh, but it was traded. It's not mine. Hyper trained. From the den. Yeah, from the den. From Jackson. Yeah, it's not mine. I, I definitely would like to... Yeah, so I don't have any shiny Ultra Beast. I want to catch one for myself. I'd rather catch... I, I want it on my own name, you know? Alright. Nine 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 is max for the oh for the dinette ores. Dang, I better spend it then. Darkness is urge once Pokemon with his own name, with his, yeah, with my own trainer name. Yeah. And it it's I don't mind. It doesn't matter to me if I well yeah to me it doesn't matter if I caught it on 3ds or Pokemon Go or DS. Like I, I don't care if. I, I go by different names on those, so it's, I mean, it's not going to say Urge to Game, but at the same time, I know I caught it, so, I mean, I count those two, the ones that transferred from other games, I, I, I count those in. But yeah, uh, this will conclude my stream for today. Lucario will be joining Lucina. Ah, okay. Uh, if you wish to continue the conversation, you can head over to the Urge to Game Discord server. Oh, and another thing too. Um, so my setup, right? My background. I uh, right here. That's actually the the, ten, the Smash Bros. Ultimate Special Edition. I have it right there. It has the uh, the steel book inside. Maybe I'll take it out. I don't know. And over here. Well, the game is covering it, but it's actually my Banjo Kazooie amiibo. Yeah, because I love Banjo-Kazooie, the video game. I really wish there was, there was a new Banjo-Kazooie game. I really want there to be a new game. Microsoft or Rare, what's going on here? <laughs> oh yeah, you don't see it. I have another one over here. Right here. It's Cappy with Luigi hat, so. Luigi hat, but then there's also Cappy. Yeah. And down here. Oh man, one of my favorite games of all time. Populous, the beginning. I still have it. The, the box. I don't know if any of you guys know what about this game. <laughs> I don't know if you guys you've even heard of this. Uh, well, I'm you've uh, you've probably heard me say about it, but before you heard it from me, I don't know if you guys have even heard about this game. 
But uh, I love this game. I still have the box when I bought this when I was a kid. This came out in the 90s on PC. They haven't come out with a new populist game since. It's actually... So it's been made by Bullfrog. That's the, the dev company. Bullfrog. But, uh... Bullfrog no longer exists. So, you know who owns the IP now? <laughs> EA owns it now. They bought out, they bought Bullfrog, and now Bullfrog doesn't exist. Hmm. Just like a lot of other game companies EA buys out. Hmm. 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 <laughs> hmm. <laughs> anyway. I'm afraid I must decline Blasina. <laughs> uh, Remixer, hi. It's been a while. You use Photoshop? Ha! Ah, me too. Alright. Well, uh, this will conclude my stream again. So, yeah, I don't know when's the next time I'm going to stream. I don't have a stream schedule yet. I just wanted to stream for today and mm, say hello to everyone. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what's the next game I'll be streaming, but I, I have a different mindset now when it comes to streaming. So, that's all I'll say. Anyway. Uh, well, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.